We're back, and this time we're with Radical. This is Will Brown, marketing manager of Radical. You have got some very, very impressive weapons in this garage today. Yeah, we certainly have. I mean, it's great to be back at the seven, second running of Most Sport Days Live with uh, a selection of our, our Radical sports cars from our range that we sell both here in the UK and around the world. Can you take us through, like, this is the SR1. Can we start here, and then we'll go down and... Uh as they increased in size and power? Yeah, so we've got three cars here at, uh, at Most Sport Days. Um, first car we have here is the SR1, which is our entry level product. Um, this is a 1340cc car, about 185 horsepower, but don't be fooled by its small size. This is a really potent bit of kit. The, the lap times around here are similar to GT4 pace, um, but it's a really great introductory product to get people into sports prototype racing. The idea with SR1 is that not only are you giving people a great package in terms of the, the car itself, but also all of the training, everything they need to get successful in sports car racing. So we give them a race suit, we give them everything they need to get their race license, um, take them through that training process, ultimately to give them the best chance of success. So it's a, it's a really good starting point to our range um, and really popular both in the UK and abroad. What's the spec of the SR1, your 0 to 60 and things like that? So 0 to 60, you're looking at a shade over uh, three seconds. Um, top speed of this is about 138, 140 mile an hour in the specification that we run here in the UK. Um, and downforce, some in the region of 1.8G, um, which is a phenomenal amount of grip through the corners. So, yeah, it's a, it's a really compact package, very lightweight. The car only weighs about 520 kilograms, uh, and that obviously is where the real performance is derived from. It's unbelievable to think that this is an entry level as well. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I said, with that sort of, you know, GT4 rivaling type pace in, a, in an entry level car, but it's also very approachable and that's yeah. that's really important because when you're bringing people into the sport, you know, as we do every year, we bring hundreds of people into racing for the first time, um, it's all about giving them something that is very, very easy to drive quickly. If you make the car really easy to drive, then it's very approachable, it gives you a lot of feedback and that ultimately means that you get confidence and you can push on. Good, okay, so you've got two SR1s and now for my favourite, this is an absolute weapon, isn't it? Yeah, so here in the middle, this is our Radical Rapture. So we launched the Rapture at the Goodwood Festival of Speed this year. Um, and Run up the hill, it was unreal. Yeah, fantastic, wasn't it? And uh, yeah, real real sight and, uh, and sound to behold. So yeah, this is our new track and road car product. So this is actually road legal as, as well as suitable for the track. Um, as you can probably tell, very similar um, sort of lineage in terms of technology, chassis technology, aerodynamics to our race car range, but in a road legal package. So this uses the, the Ford turbocharged EcoBoost engine. It's about 350 horsepower, a huge amount of torque. So, I mean, this is a real, real formidable track weapon, about 165, 170 mile an hour, um, and, and 0 to 60 in the, in the high sort of 2.8, three second mark. Oh and I cannot believe that that is road legal. <laughs> And everything about it screams downforce and speed, doesn't it? Yeah, and it's crazy at the same time, of course, to think in a, in a track day car, and track focus car, you've also got things like electric mirrors, you've got a heater in there, 12 volt socket, all the things you wouldn't expect to find in a super stripped out track day car, and yet the car only tips the scales at about 725 kilograms. So still dynamically spectacular. I get to have a ride in it tomorrow as well. Have you taken it out yet this morning? Yeah, so the Radical Rapture's been out this morning. Um, one of our long-standing customers has come all the way from Canada to test the car, obviously blown away by the performance, and he's driven a wealth of different models, um, including the SR3, which, of course, is the other model we have here as well. Yes, like, OK, let's keep going. What was it like? How's it handling the ret? The, the ret? The ret, whatever word that is. The, the, and I was going to say the Wayne. <laughs> <laughs> the Wayne and the Rhett, how's it handling that? Well, the guys who've been out on track so far have commented just how grippy it is actually, which is great, considering it's not the best conditions today. Obviously, it's been uh, a bit wet and drizzly this morning, but no, everyone said that the circuit is really, actually really grippy, which is, is great, obviously, for people trying these cars for the first time. Um, the great thing about the partnership that we have with, with Hankook as our official tyre supplier is that we've got a bespoke tyre package, um, and that's really designed specifically for the car to work in tandem with the rest of the package. So that's what, again, is, is all part of that confidence giving package is having a tire that works in harmony with the rest of the car. Yeah. But, um, so yeah, we're standing in front of the, the SR3 here and this is our long standing best selling car. We've been selling the SR3 since 2002. Um, and there's around 1200 of these in racing and track day activity around the world. Um, so uh, yeah, mainstay of the range, two seater car, a little bit bigger than the SR1 
um, powered by 1500cc motorcycle derived engine, so about 260 horsepower at the, at the flywheel. This will generate up to 2.1G in the corners, real face sapping, you know, real extreme cornering force. It's a formidable track day car, isn't it? Yeah, this is a really, really quick car. And the great thing about the SR3 is it flatters both the beginner and the uh, sort of seasoned professional. So when we run our championships and, and pretty much all of our international and UK championships permit the, the, uh, the Radical SR3, it's kind of our core model for all of our racing. Um, a lot of it is, is a two driver format, so you have the option, you can either race on your own or you can race as a, either an AMAM or a Pro-AM pairing. And the great thing about the SL3 is that it's, it's a really adaptable package. So whether you're coming into the sport for the first time and getting to grips with this kind of car, the SL3 is great for that. But also, even if you've spent 20, 30 years as a seasoned professional, it never stops teaching you new things. You know, it's kind of the, it's almost the race car for life. I'd quite like this to be my race car for life. Good, and? Whew. It's possibly the hottest car in the garage, that one. Yeah, so, we're, so we've, got, we've got two SR3s in here. So this fantastic livery here, and this is a special edition one here with the, with the silver chassis. Um, so uh, yeah, that's, so we're using these for, for test and trial days through the, across the weekend. We've got about 40 trial days booked in over the next two days. Oh, wow. So uh, yeah, busy time for the team. So they're just about to head out now? Yeah, just about to head out now. So the Radical Works team are just getting the guys comfortable in terms of the seating position. Um, and our track instructors, uh, and we, we, you know, we run, as well as motorsport days, we run somewhere in the region of, of 20 of these trial days across the year where customers can come and experience the product. Um, motorsport days is a fantastic event because it sort of brings us to a, an audience of people who are looking for next year, you know, and it's, it's, it's difficult often to find the advice and the guidance you need when you're looking to get into racing or you're looking to, to get into involved in track days to find all that information in one place. This is such a valuable asset, it's such a great event to have, to you know, be able to find teams, to find constructors, to find driver coaching, to be able to find people that sell race kit, all that, you know, all the ancillary stuff that you need behind the scenes, you know, in one place is fantastic. So no, we're, you know, we're really pleased to be here again and, uh, and look forward to, to looking after all these people across the next two days. Thank you very much. The gentleman that's in there right now, um, who is he? What's his background? Is he a newbie? Yeah, so we've got a mixture of newbies, we've got a mixture of, of season racers as well, so I believe uh, we've got a couple of guys coming in uh, from Caterham that are testing in the next session. Um, we've had some drivers uh, that are looking to switch from yeah, via the tin top formula as well, but quite a few people that are looking to make the step from track days. So a real mix of different drivers, different abilities, uh, and obviously we've got the range, the breadth of the range to... Yeah. to, to with the range, presumably you'll have people who'll start with the SR1 and then you'll effectively guide them through. That's that's the object, yeah, that's the idea is that you start in SR1, you can press through SR3, maybe go and race a little bit internationally as well in Europe and we have what we call a race the world which is a concept of linking together all of our international championships. So just as you would with any other sport, if you go and play your sport around the world, the rules remain the same, it's just where you're playing and who you're playing against that changes and it's the same for our championships. The idea is it's the same common idea, you're still using the same type of car and the regulations are broadly similar but you'd be racing against different people and you'd be racing a different circuit. So if you want to go and race at great circuits like Spa-Francorchamps in Belgium or Bathurst in Australia, Circuit of the Americas in the States, you know, all these kind of real famous bucket list circuits, we've got the ability to network all that together. But ultimately, we've had drivers gone to do all kinds of great things. So Colin Noble, who was uh, our first SL1 Cup champion, of course, European Le Mans Series champion LMP3 last year. Yeah, we've had guys migrate, uh, Jack Manchester, who's gone on to do British G3 in European Le Mans. Um, we've got guys who've, who've gone from SR1 and SR3 into Porsche Carrera Cup. Yeah, a lot of very successful faces that have ultimately made it into in Sport and Stewart's car. It's a great place to cut your teeth if you want to learn skills, because I think what people underestimate is just how competitive our championships are. They're hard to win, and they should be, you know, particularly at a national level like SR3. Yeah, that's something we pride ourselves on. So, there are obviously people out there watching Facebook Live who are sitting at home and should be here at Silverstone. If they do buy a ticket for today or tomorrow, they can obviously come down, have a chat with you, and what can there be their experience down here in Radical? Well, yeah, come and see us. I mean, we've got a very, very small limited hours uh, today. Today, we've filled all our slots, which is fantastic. There's a limited number available tomorrow. But otherwise, yeah, come down and see us. 
One of the big announcements for today is we've announced our 2020 challenge dates, um, which is great. So next year's calendar is out there, so people can start making plans for next year's racing. Some great national circuits on there, Silverstone, Brands, Donington, Snetterton, Alton Park, Spa Francorchamps as a season finale. I mean, who doesn't want to do that? So, um, you know, great day. But yeah, if basically the, the you know our message is if you don't know how to go racing, you don't know where to go racing, you want advice and guidance and somebody to help you do that journey easily, then come down and talk to us. You know, we've got the tools, we've got the the strength of numbers, the scale of the business both here and around the world to help you achieve your dream.